Coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Kimbo Slice and Stefan Struve. This is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes it truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. All right, here he is, the one, the only, the inimitable Kimbo Slice. No denying the power, no denying the mass appeal. When Kimbo Slice makes the walk and competes in a high-profile MMA fight, the masses tune in. Yes, they do tune in. Some of the biggest nights in the UFC or any organization he's ever fought is attributed to Kimbo Slice. Yeah. He has an ability to just draw people in from the internet to the octagon. Kimbo Slice is always one of the biggest stars. Now, a lot of it is because of his personality, but they didn't pull up those Kimbo Slice videos to see him dancing. They pulled it up to see him fight, and Kimbo Slice, at his heart, at his core, is a fighter. No denying the power he has in both hands. He brings that to the table, and don't let the aesthetic fool you. Kimbo Slice might be the nicest guy on this roster top to bottom. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters with big differences in height and reach. We go inside the octagon, here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 33 wins, 13 losses. He stands seven feet tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Beaverwick, the Netherlands, Stefan Skyscraper! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of five wins, two losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 225 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, Kimbo! Slice! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. Dan Mergliata. All right, so two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight they get someone that a lot oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Can't take many of those. You better check. And they separate. Oh, big left. Right hook to the head, blocked. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. And he landed the right hand there. Yeah, it looks a little wobbly. He didn't feet. like that left hand. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't we'll finish this fight. Back to the feet. Good right hand. Oh, nice. Oh, connects with the one-two. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Oh, bleeding from his cheek now. That can't feel good. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. 
that's a big strike right there. Nice combination of strikes there. Oh! He's in trouble. Man, he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent for a very bad. He's out! Just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched him. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight, but both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliante has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 54 seconds in the very first round. Declare the winner by... Oh, oh.